here they come at the Meadowlands. And they're off. Hello everyone, Wendy Ross for U.S. Trotting. Hamiltonian week is rolling on and it's certainly heating up here as we make a stop in New Egypt, New Jersey with trainer Lucas Wallen and take a look at the favorite, his star trotting colt, Rebuff. Joined now by trainer Lucas Wallen. Lucas, let's just go back to last year, 2021. You had a drive in the Hamiltonian. Of course, you drove Quattro de Julio. And this year, you have a horse you're training in the Hamiltonian. I, I mean, a little different vibe from being the, in a driver last year to now you have a trainer and you're training one. Not only are you training one, but you got a heavy favorite. Yeah, hopefully it works, but, uh, works out better this year than it did uh, last year. But uh, now we're, we're going into the Hamble very confident and uh, excited. Last year, as a two-year-old rebuff, really came on the scene late, taking us all by storm there. Lexington and then, of course, into the Breeders' Crown. I think you knew ending his two-year-old year that you were going to have a special colt coming back at three. Yeah, absolutely. He showed at uh, plenty of races last year, and uh, when we turned him out, he he was in 100% shape, and uh, we were very confident we were going to have a, a very good three-year-old. But uh, yeah, everything looks good so far. You know, we stopped by here on our trips out to Jersey in April, and we were like, "Where's Rebuff? He was just kind of chilling out in the field. No rush, bringing him back at three. Now, fast forward two or three months, we're into August. Seems like things have worked out. The timing is working itself out perfectly, hitting uh, to be ready for for these Hamiltonian weeks. Yeah, absolutely. We said uh, after the British Show, we said we're gonna take our time and bring him back nice and slowly and we figured that uh, New York Society they come a little too early so we said we aim for Reynolds and Stanley Dancer and then Hamba Elimination and everything had worked out perfect for him. Last year at two, you know, Timmy doing the, at the controls last year, of course, coming back here at three, you guys kind of had the tactics where you raced him a, a little bit conservatively, keeping teaching him along the way. But now coming back here, especially in the dancer, you and Timmy said, let's shake him up a little bit. Let's see what we can do. And he's been aggressive, racing more aggressive coming into the Hamiltonian. Yeah, uh, we raced him every single start last year. We raced him from behind and uh, uh, first start this year we did the same and then in the Stanley Dancer we changed it up a little bit and uh, made sure he uh, he handled that too and uh, he sure does. In his elimination last week, one in hand, it, it seems like it's at this point it's not, it's, it's just every week we're letting out a new gear. Timmy kind of, you know, had post eight, got away, eased his way to the front, never an anxious moment, crossed the line, just completely loaded up. I think like, is there still a gear yet to hit is the question. We think so, we think so, and he's a very nice and smart colt, and he's just waiting, waiting on the other horses, you know, playing with his ears and tell them to try to pass him, you know, but uh, uh, we think he have one and two gears left, so uh, we'll see. This year for you at 27 years old, it's a big year, you've gotten married, we have a little baby on the way with your, your new wife, Michaela, uh, you know, a lot of big things, but here to win the Hamiltonian, you, you've kind of built this stable up year by year, and it's just continued to grow and progress. To be in the Hamiltonian as a trainer this year, what does it mean to you? Uh, everything, you know, this is what everyone works for, and uh, uh, to be in the Hamiltonian and to be to have one of the favorites, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a dream come through. And um, uh, it's, so far we're having a big year with marriage and a kid coming, and uh, this will be this will be pretty cool too. Best of luck. Thank you very much. Thank you.